The next option here you'll see is reminders and alerts. Again, this is a pretty neat function. Uh, you can turn various things on or off based on your preferences. And the way you do that is you go in here under preferences and here's all of the different alerts and reminders that you can turn on or off. Um, so you can have reminders for maintenance uh, to change your furnace filter. This is one thing that a lot of homeowners often forget. Um, you can go in there, enable the reminder, and then here you can even choose your frequency. Do you want it one month, three months? I mean, you've got um, even based on runtime hours. Uh, so there's a lot of functionality uh, in that reminder, and you base that on the last time you changed your filter. So once you enable it, determine what frequency you want, and tell it when your last filter was changed, now consistently you will receive a reminder to change your furnace filter. Uh, if you've got UV lamps, you've got reminders there, uh, but the two that I'm most happy with here are your low temp and high temp alert. So here, by default, you're going to get an alert if your temperature gets below 50 deg degrees or above 92. Now those settings are customizable as well. If you want it at 55 or 45, you can go in and change those uh, alert settings as well. In some areas, uh, now where we are, we're pretty much in a desert, and so humidity isn't a, a big issue for us. But in some areas, especially high humidity can affect things, and you can set both low and high humidity alerts to be able to be notified of, of any change that you're particularly fond of. Um, from there, uh, heating and cooling alerts are automatically enabled, as well as the display alerts on the thermostat. So if you get an alert, uh, it will display on the, the main screen that you actually have a notification. Back in your Reminders and Alerts main menu, up at the very top, if you ended up having an alert or a reminder, uh, it'll tell you up here, here are reminders, we don't have any, but alerts, we have two, uh, and mostly that's because we've had this sitting in a very cold warehouse and our temperature's gotten below 50 degrees in here. To be able to clear those out though, you just come in, you tap on it, hit OK. Um, once you've read them, typically from there, uh, it'll end up going back and, and resetting your alerts and reminders.